I'm Georgie and this is your Week in Tech. Black Swan, a tech and data science firm based in London, has received £3 million in funding in a round led by Mitsui. Charlie HR provides free HR platforms for small businesses and it has raised £1 million in seed funding from Connect Ventures and early stage fund Seed Camp. Blockchain intelligence firm Elliptic has closed a $5 million Series A funding round led by Paladin Capital Group, a Washington-based VC specialising in disruptive security applications. Aperio, the provider of a real-time legal fee tracking platform, has secured £1.7 million in seed funding. GoCardless has bought in $13 million to build out its global bank-to-bank -bank payment network. It's now processing £1 billion in annual payments for over 16,000 merchants. Dyson will invest £1 billion in new battery technology after reporting a 20% rise in profits thanks to their continuing expansion in China. The company have invested in a University of Michigan spin-off called Sacti3, who've managed to develop a solid-state technology that can store twice as much energy as traditional rechargeable batteries. Dyson's move into the battery field means they'll now be competing with the likes of Tesla. Uber is continuing to cause controversy across the world by upsetting local taxi drivers. Thousands of taxi drivers have caused traffic chaos in the Indonesian capital of Jakarta this week. It's the second major protest by taxi drivers this month. They say competition from ride-hailing apps such as Uber and Grab have severely reduced their income and that they don't face the same costs and regulations as they do. Our download of the week is Cover. Here are Freddie and James to tell you a little bit more. Cover is a mobile app that lets you get insured on a friend's car for as little as an hour, on demand. Takes about two minutes to download the app and set up your account. After that point, it's less than 30 seconds to buy a policy. Download it today to get your own personalised pricing. And finally, Twitter celebrated its 10th birthday this week. The past decade has seen the microblogging site play a part in world events, including the Arab Spring, created the hashtag, and has shared news, posts, gifts and vines amongst its 300 million strong network. The most popular tweet of them all, Ellen DeGeneres' 2014 Oscar selfie. This has been your Week in Tech. For more, check out Tech City News and follow us on Twitter.